John. It has been a while since we talked, and obviously you've been hard at work in that time. What does this mean for BlackBerry? What does this mean for cars? Well, uh, yeah, thank you. I have been, haven't, haven't chatted a long time. And yes, we've been very hard at work. And by the way, this project we've been working with um, Amazon had taken us probably about two years. Um, we started this whole program about two years ago at CES. We demonstrated a little piece of technology at that time, and obviously not as elaborate as today. But at that time, we already had the vision of really building a data analytics platform uh, from A to Z, you know, end to end, uh, for application provider, for car manufacturers, for consumer to be able to tap into in a secure and seamless manner. So that's what that, well, that's what it does for the market, and that's what does for customers. And obviously, BlackBerry create a data business that we don't have. And I long wanted a recurring data business, so this this may promise to be a good one uh, down the road. Now, you talked up QNX to me years ago, and I'm curious how critical a role uh, you believe BlackBerry will pay, play in cars as a result of the work that you have done. Um, could you repeat the last part? How I'm having trouble hearing, bro. Go ahead. You, you talked up you talked up QNX years ago, you know, when this was just a nascent technology and believed back then that BlackBerry would play a huge role in cars. What is the technology that you have that Amazon wants and needs? Um, well, QNX is a secure safety certified operating system, which has achieved the highest level of safety certifications. Um, I think that's very important to Amazon. The other part is we're very hard at work in the IoT space, which Amazon said make a lot of investment themselves. And so, and the alignment of the fact that we, like Andy said, Jesse said yesterday at their reInvent conference, we could redefine how the industry works together. And, and so at data analytics, uh, machine learning, um, you know, it sounds like I'm throwing all the buzzword out, but it's true. Uh, and, 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 and the kind of the IoT enabling um, with our safety certified environment and the platform we could build to um, emulate everything that's happening, including the census, uh, those are the technology that is interesting to Amazon. Might you have other partnerships on the horizon with other big car makers, a company like Tesla, perhaps? We, uh, we, we are speaking to a number of them. Some of them sounds more advanced and more promising. It's a little too early for us to talk about wins. Uh, and and when, when it happens, uh, I'll, I'll sure to make, I'll make, I'll sure to let you know, how's that? <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Well, look, Apple and Google all have car tech integrations and platforms, but it's taken time to see these things get to market. How do you compare what they offer, where they are, to where BlackBerry is and what BlackBerry has to offer? I know they're all to, different technology. Yeah, it, it's a very broad subject, but I, I think of two things that are more unique. Uh, first of all, we've been in the business a lot longer in the auto business a lot longer than Apple and Google has been uh, in the auto business. So we have an ongoing stream of customers and, and revenue. Uh, and so, and we're expanding that in a, just now I said, I, I, I spoke about the data, data driven uh, revenue. Um, so so that's, that's number one. Number two is we do a lot of the pumping, you know, a, a lot of the secure back channel um, communications, kind of a trusted broadcasting um, messaging. We do a lot of those, uh, safety, hypervisors, clusters, you know, those, those things that makes the whole dashboard looks pretty. Uh, you know, they do a lot more user interface. Uh, our orientation, a lot more about the ecosystem. Their orientation about the user, um, which Amazon is very strong in, and this is one of the 
big reasons why we want to partner with Amazon because they bring the consumer and the user experience and interfaces to us. So, um, so, so that's the difference between us and Apple versus um, um, uh, Google. The other last point that I think is a very important point is our technology, this collaboration we talk about, uh, we just announced, um, allows a car manufacturer to own their own customer. In some of the names that you just mentioned, we will not allow that to happen. They will own the data and therefore they will own the customers. I don't own the data, I don't interpret the data, I just transport it. 